And then the other day we made a Mexican pizza. I had some leftover tortillas and all the cheese and beans and good stuff. And then I thought, let's make a hot dog burrito with the leftovers. Isn't that going to be great? <laughs> I think so. When I first thought of it, I was going to put just a hot dog and a slice of cheese wrapped around there and put these in the air fryer. But then I thought, I have all these good things left over, and it's going to be like a burrito anyway, so let's make a burrito out of it. Okay? The Ballpark Franks Grill Master. Birdie Beef. You know how we like them. I'm just going to make two, because I'm not that hungry. Good size, right? When I cook these, I like to put slits in them, or this way or that way, on the grill, but I'm just going to cut a little bit, because I know it's going to expand. This is going to be so easy. Look, first I'm going to put down a little bit of salsa. Not too much. We don't want it too soggy. But we want it good. What do you think? You like this idea? Make it how you like. What's a burrito without some black beans? Not too much. You could load it up. But I just don't want it falling all over the place. Blend of Mexican cheese, free cheese blend. Did I miss anything? Extra cheese is okay. We're gonna roll these up. I'm gonna move the hot dog up to the end here. I'm gonna fold the end over on the bottom. Like a nice handsome burrito. Fold this end over. I'm going to put a wooden toothpick in here. Right through the hot dog. Oh! And down here. What do you think of that? You love that. <laughs> Wait till we eat it. Remember, push the hot dog up that way. Fold the bottom over. Fold the side over nice and neatly. And this one, tuck it in, like that. Somebody's banging something, what's going on out there? Quit your banging! And that is so easy. I have my Kasori air fryer back here. I'm gonna put it in for 15 minutes at 350 degrees. I might look at it halfway because I might want to flip it over. I should put these in a rotisserie or something. Mm -hmm. These are going to be good any way you make them. Come up here and I'll show you. This is the Kasori air fryer. I said that already. Take our beautiful works of art. I'm going to put a little olive oil cooking spray on the bottom and the top. Just to maybe help it brown a little more. Woo! Because I like it crispy. A bit on top. Probably don't have to do that. <laughs> We're cooking healthy. Look at them. 350 for 15 minutes. Push play. I'm gonna look at them in about seven minutes. You making some? Gonna be good. I'm starting to smell it and I'm impatient, so I'm gonna peek in there. You wanna look in there with me? Okay. Whoa! Oh, 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 oh. <sighs> Oh, I might have turned them over now. Oh, Jesus melted. See, this is the first time I made these, so I wasn't sure of the time. Where did one toothpick go? Oh, oh it's going to be good. good. Oh. All right, let's go another three or four minutes instead of the whole 15. This is how we learn, see? Mmm, I'm probably going to have to let it cool too, aren't I? I'm gonna check it again. Uh, that so. mm. Ooh. You like them like this? <laughs> I do. I sure do. I don't know. One more minute. Okay. Yes. Okay, so that was seven minutes total, right? Look at that hot dog sticking out of there. Don't forget to remove your toothpicks. 
that's a hot dog and cheese burrito <laughs> with beans and salsa inside. Let me put it on my fancy eating plate. If I eat off a fruit plate, does that mean I'm eating healthier? Hmm? Come on over. Uh, I gotta let this cool a little bit. <laughs> I'm gonna taste it. I'm letting them cool. Remove the toothpicks. One, two, three, four. How about... You gotta make these. Alright, it's getting cool enough to handle. Look at the beans inside of there. Can you see that? Beans and cheese and salsa. Do you want one? Oh, sure. Or you want to make your own? You like everything in here? I do like it. It looks perfect. So you got a food plate over there? I'll give you one. Okay. Mm. Look at them. Are you put any other I toppings? might put some sriracha. This is where you can dress it up how you like. You could have also made it how you liked inside. You could have put peppers or onions in there. Or just hot dog and cheese. Or hot dogs and beans. Right? We all like that. Put a little sriracha right there. Basco, whatever you got around. Hot sauce. I want to take a bite like this first. I'm going in. I'm doing it. Hope it's not hot in there. It looks beautiful, don't it? That's a hot dog. Ballpark Frank. <laughs> How hot can it be? The air fryer made it nice and crispy, which I like a lot. Not completely 100% crispy, but around the edges, right where you like it. You know? I'll need some more. Mmm. Woo! Mmm! Mmm! That's a good stuff! Mmm! <laughs> mm -hmm. Thank you. Take a crunchy bite. There it is. Hear that? <laughs> Hear that from across the studio? Wow. Mm. Wow, that's a winner. Right now, mine's very hot. I'm going to You got a mild bite there, huh? Mm hmm. That's really good, Rick. Mm hmm. The beans and the cheese and the salsa. It's a hot dog burrito. Okay, thanks for watching. Try this in your air fryer. Whatever kind you have, we have three or four around here. Talk to you soon. You like it? Yeah, I like another it. Another one? We I got like more it. hot dogs. <laughs> yeah. See you later. <laughs> Bye, thanks. <laughs> I'm gonna get another one. Oh, oh.